Kenny who won the toss and they've opted to play from uh, right to left in the first half. The two teams were watching the match on the big screen right now. They're watching this one where it'll end up from Brian Concanon's lob. And that's beautifully over the crossbar. And a second point for Galway and they've made a very, very good start here. Yeah, that was made by a huge work rate. Owen Murphy came off his line and he was tackled. There's Concanon came out feeling curled that in lovely over the bar. Kilkenny go again, look to try and get this one to stick inside and it's TJ Reid, classic style by TJ Reid, beautiful opening to the match by him in his 80th championship game. Yeah, and that was badly needed to see, he just used his experience, drifted in behind, read it really well and makes it look so easy. TJ Reid going out to try and get involved there, having scored a point earlier on, Kilkenny's only score. Stalebait situation, eventually it's Keen Kenny who picks it up. Plays it outside here as far as David Blanchfield. Blanchfield advancing. Nice ball inside here to Keown. Mossy Keown has usually got a goal in him. And he's got another one here. What a response. His 11th ever championship goal comes after eight minutes. Yeah, brilliant teamwork there. Keen Kenny won that rook ball. But look at David Blanchfield. Made the run, popped it over the top. And Keown very, very cool and a super finish. And that's typical to Kenny. You know, even after a few minutes, they look to be in big trouble. But to fight back straight away. Two points between them, thanks to Mossy Cohn playing in his fifth ever Leinster final. Nicely forward for Billy Ryan. Didn't start the last match, but gets an opportunity here. Down to Kean Kenny. Kenny looks at the target, looking to put Kilkenny in front for the first time in this match with his opening point of the game. There are ten and a half minutes gone, and it's Kilkenny who lead here by one, four to six points. Down into the mix there. Garrod McInerney just gets a hand to it. Helped out by Cahill Mannion. After a good start by Galway, they're in trouble again. Owen Cody, good save. Out for a 65. Nice piece of goalkeeping by Anna Murphy this time. Once again, defence was cruelly exposed. And Owen Cody very nearly made them pay. Yeah, Cahill Mannion went to play a little ball across the field. Owen Cody stepped in. And as Kilkenny do, only do, they go for goals. They head for the goals. And in fairness, a nice height for Anna Murphy. But a good save all the same. And out for 65. Now can Galway build up something here? Huge one down. Ready for the break here was Whelan. He read it well as a goal for the taking. And he's got it. Conor Whelan's 15th ever goal. And it comes, as you can see, after 17 minutes. And Henry Shefflin must be a little bit more relieved now. The teams are level now for the second time. Yeah, terrible mix up there in the Kilkenny defence. You see the two lads in under the one ball, Paddy Deegan and Tommy Walsh. And Conor Whelan read it very well, but it, you know, basic mistake from the Kilkenny defence and a lovely, lovely simple finish by uh, Conor Whelan. Walter Walsh now. Walter, the big towering figure, coming in and putting it in the corner of the net and getting his seventh ever championship goal in this year's Leinster final. The catch, brilliantly done by Walter. And then all very much his own work, sticking it right in the corner. 2-6 to 1-9. Yeah, that's unbelievable. I was wondering when he caught it, did he have the pace of old? And just watch here, he just throws the ball up, just takes the extra step and wham, down against the ground, unstoppable, brilliant goal. That was wonderfully taken by Conor Whelan ahead of David Blanchfield. That wasn't an easy win. This man is on fire today. Great score. A goal and three by Conor Whelan. Hell scoreless against Dublin, wasn't his day then, but the mark of a great player, to put that behind him, to come here and to really up his standard once again, tremendous, tremendous score. Nicely over, Blanchfield, legitimate pass, the referee says, Walter Welch hitting it, and Walter Welch putting it over the crossbar. He's got a goal and a point now, Walter. And it is back to a one-point game once again, 112 to 28. Tom Monaghan slipping it all the way back where it started from. Cahill Mannion once again. And that shot from Mannion goes all the way. It's only taken about 20 seconds. And Cahill Mannion with his first point of the second half and first point of the match indeed putting Galway back into the lead again yeah beautiful strike he makes it look easy he's so influential in this game 
down towards Joseph Cooney again it comes but brilliantly caught in the air this time by David Blanchfield Blanchfield for Kilkenny ready to take it back once again challenged vigorously there by Kevin Cooney got the ball in here as far as Butler Mikey Butler has got his first ever championship goal <laughs> coming after 39 minutes a player that Kilkenny fans absolutely love it came from that huge catch and then just watch this one playing inside here and Butler carried it on himself Michael yeah, I think there was two one twos there this, what is it about Kilkenny you know another corner back itself tap it over the bar you know I said it about Evan Nile a minute ago the minute he saw the, the goal was on he went for them what a finish into the far corner no chance for Anna Murphy brilliant goal he's absolutely dynamic Mannion leaving it in here goalkeeper comes out stops it got there ahead of Kevin Cooney great goalkeeping again by Owen Murphy one of the very best in the business this afternoon we saw Nicky Quaid down in Limerick do his stuff and we're seeing Owen Murphy do it here at Croke Park Walter Welsh right now up into the sky it goes and over the crossbar it goes as well Walter Welsh with a goal and two Kilkenny are rampant and they are flying in this match and they're ahead at this stage by 316 to 115. Can Galway do something about it? Brian Concannon, one point from the match so far, laid on a goal as well for Conor Whelan. And they're coming again, and it's the out of four mentioned Whelan inside here. Finn! They're back in business! That's exactly what the game required! Yeah, and a great call, Jerry. You said it about Jason Flynn. He has that ability. But again, Conor Whelan was quiet since half time. But look at this for a run. And look at the vision and the little pass. Took three Kilkenny men out of it. And a great finish. Uh, Owen Murphy had no chance. He's down hurt now as well in the goal mode. It was Whelan who set it up. A lovely pass. And Jason Flynn has scored his ninth ever championship goal. And now there are just five between them. Slip back. Connor Whelan now fancying one from a distance it's way way up into the sky the umpires look and go for the white flag and Whelan's got his first point of the second half and make that a goal and four now his contribution Porrick Walsh comes across Connor Whelan picks it up takes it out to the side here to make space for himself beat the attempted block but it's uh, on the netting and it's over the bar a goal and six by Conor Whelan having one of those days he's inspired and he's inspiring those around him and once again it's back to a three point game Brian Cody living on his nerves as well I'd imagine Kilkenny just ahead by one are they to win the title yet again they're looking to get another score here Porrick Welch has got one already blocked down brilliantly that time Porrick Mannion got in the block Billy Ryan surrounded by Galway players and they win it eventually, Galway. They take it out of that group. Sean Linan had it. Delivered out of danger eventually. Huge clearance by Cahal Mannion. All the way down towards Concanon. Breaks loose here as far as Nylon. And Nylon has leveled up the match. He's got 11 points. Just like in Limerick. It's a cliffhanger. Absolutely, Gerard. Again, what a block by Parik Mannion. We've been mentioning him throughout the game. And then Cahal Mannion onto the ball. And what a second half we've had here in Crow Park down towards Owen Cody batted down somehow taken there by TJ Brennan almost stepped out over the sideline plays it down there's a man unmarked in there and that man could well score and that man has scored and Brian Concanon has got a third and Galway are ahead by two with about 30 seconds of the five minutes still left to play Kilkenny won't give up a goal would surely win it for them Kilkenny still battling ahead. TJ Reid almost got to that. The sun might have been in his eyes. Sean Lennon's back there to keep it away from him. Last few seconds. 3.21 to 2.26. It is 32 points to 30. Galway trying to win it again. Joseph Cooney almost losing it. He has lost it to Kean Kenny. And then lost it again. TJ Reid takes it up, blocked down by whoever went in to challenge him that time. Everybody putting in everything they possibly got. And finally, here's an opportunity. Killian Buckley, he can win it for Kilkenny. He may have done so. What a conclusion here. Killian Buckley, of all people. What a performance. He's never scored before in the championship any kind of goal. He may well have denied Galway the title here. He did, it's all over. 
What a finish, Porrick Mannion, who was absolutely brilliant, lost his heart, kicked the ball out. Where did Killian Buckley come from? That's the greatest Kilkenny win of all. That's the way to do it. They're never beaten. Galway will be absolutely devastated. I haven't hurled the way back into it. But what a finish. What a goal and what a game of hurling we've had here. The final score here, Kilkenny. Four.